Hi everybody. Um, I'm 38 weeks today, and I'm making this video. It's not gonna be very long, so I'm very tired. Um, we haven't really had anything to update. I've been really tired. I made it here. No one thought I would, but I did. So that's exciting. Um, he's completely like pretty much below my belly button now. He's so low. It's ridiculous. And, um, Friday, my doctor might strip my membranes. And I was wondering, if it, for anyone who's had it done, did it really work? Because I know my friend Jennifer got it done, and it worked in a couple of days. My grandma did, but I remember, I remember Jessica got it done, like Gabe and Jess, but I remember if it worked or not. So, if Jessica, if you watch this, please, please let me know if it worked for you or not. And anyone else who's possibly had their membrane stripped, see if it worked in the past couple of days like they're supposed to. I can't see. Seriously. Trooper, stop. Right. He's getting really big, see? So. <laughs> he likes to top my other cat. She is very upset with him. Um, oh, Oh, I'm two centimeters dilated, and I'm like, it was like 85% of face or 95% face. I don't remember which one it was, but it was almost there. It was just kind of thick a bit, so that's it. And, um, my last appointment is tomorrow, so hopefully you guys get back to me ASAP, because the ship and the members are happening tomorrow. <laughs> So, I hope so. I hope she actually goes through with it. Because she told me last week that she would do it, but half the time she does that, and then you go in, and nothing happens. So, we will see. Um, he's kicking. Oh, well, not kicking. He's like me and me and my pet right now. Um, so, he's working so much. He works every day from like 7 o'clock in the morning to like 3 o'clock. It's ridiculous. Because. I would have to, like, I wake up with them every day. So, I mean, like, getting in the habit anyway because I'm going to be waking up with baby soon. So, I might as well wake up with them when he gets ready for work and I help him get ready for work and everything. And so, that's cool, but... Oh, congratulations to Rebecca. Summer is beautiful and I love her name so much. Ah, she's so pretty. She has so much hair. Ah, it's crazy. Rylan is not going to have, like, any hair. I'm not heartburn or anything. So I, don't, I think it's going to have, like, peach fuzz. If, if that, I was born with peach fuzz. So we will see. Um, we're getting, we're not going to get a bassinet. Like, we were going to buy a bassinet. And we decided that we didn't want to spend so much money. Even, like, Craigslist, they were expensive. Like, just as much as buying a new one. So we decided that we didn't want to spend so much money on something that, isn't gonna he's only gonna use for a couple months. So what we are doing is we're actually buying the portable play art where it's like it's a play pen but then it has a bassinet built in where you write, raise the mattress and it's like it's a very shallow one and that way it turns into a full size bassinet and then I can drop down the mattress later and it'd be a full size playpen. That way he can he can grow with it and I'll be able to get years out of it instead of just a couple months. For the same price. It's sixty two dollars. So we're gonna get that we're gonna order that tomorrow. So I'm really excited. And I don't have anything else to update. I don't really think there's anything else. It's gonna be a short update because I've been feeling good. Oh, someone had a question for me and so I told her that I would I would answer it. Um she asked if I've had increased gas since I got pregnant. Sorry if that girth is sending you guys out. Um, I really haven't had that much. I really didn't have gas in the first place. <laughs> like, I never really had gas. And so, like, it didn't really increase a lot. Like, it did, but, like, where I actually got some before, I never, I never had gas. But, and since I got pregnant, I've had some here and there, but not really, like, extreme or anything. But it does happen to people. Like, it is normal. So don't worry about it. Um, my pregnancy symptom has been bloody noses. I've never, ever had bloody noses before. I got pregnant, like, randomly, ever. And now I wake up with one at, like, 3 o'clock in the morning every night. Like, I really do. And it's just bad. <laughs> I hate it. Because you can just feel it. And most of the time it won't come out of my nose, but it's, like, bloody. But the other night it actually was, like, coming out of my nose. And it was just bad. So... 
so that's crazy. Sorry, my cat is too prone to so alone. <laughs> but anyways, I will show you guys my belly, and that will be it because I really have nothing else to update that I can't remember right now. So let's see. Oh, Chipper. Leave me alone. Sorry. Chipper! Gosh, he's so mean. Though. That's my belly. There's nothing up here. I don't know if you guys can see how absolutely low it is, but it, it's really low. I haven't grown anymore. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys that. Um, when I went to the doctor's, um, the other day, like, last week, um, I haven't grown anymore. Like, he's not growing. He's done growing. So, they might do an early inducement. It depends on if he's grown or not. Uh, I have my appointment tomorrow, because last week I was still measuring at 34, 35 weeks. So she hasn't grown in a couple of weeks. So, because he has no more room. So she said he's going to be estimated at about five or five and a half, like five, five and a half pounds. So we'll see how big he's going to be. But she said he's very healthy, so it's okay. And so we have nothing to worry about. But if he's not growing, there's no reason for him to really be in there longer than he has to. So that's my update. And I will see you guys for... 39 weeks, if I make it there. I hope I do. I, well, no, I thought I wouldn't be here. <laughs> so, bye.